Hey guys, in this video I am going to be checking out the Redeemer Tehran build for the Cerberus. This build can actually output a lot of damage, so I really want to show you guys that. It is kind of hard to do it because the Cerberus is really weak as you can see here. It's weaker than the Hawk. You just need to play it correctly. Here are my pilot skills for the Cerberus, Armor Expert and Mechanic, which I do need to upgrade when I get the right pilot. Today I'm also going to be running the Nightingale with the Stellar Wasp that I got from the Operation E and this looks really cool with the Dragon Marquis so I'm going to be running that as well. So we are going to be doing some games with this, actually I think I might change my Titan. Hmm, what should I run? Um, I might go with the Minos actually. So yeah, I'll set up the Minos and we'll jump into some games. Okay, so we have dropped in on Dreadnought map. Oh, this, this looks so good. I'm so glad they added this. Right, so we need to try and get within the 350 meter range. Probably the only downside to this build, because it's very dangerous for such a weak bot. So this guy's getting pretty close, and this guy too, let's go for him. Ooh, actually, see, this shield's not the best. I mean, it does its job sometimes, but it's pretty weak. Overall, the Cerberus is really weak, but you actually can get some great setups on this. Let's just fire at this guy. We should break his shield. Yeah, there we go. He broke his shield so quickly. I think the Lancelot shield has three parts, so you have to break like three parts of it to actually um, get full damage on it. We have another Cerberus over here. He has like Tehran's and a Nucleon. This guy's going up here. Come on, we need to kill him. Ooh, if you look at that damage, then we just use this to suppress him. Oh, the other Cerberus got the kill. Okay, so I don't really know where to go in this map still. I mean, center's pretty annoying because it's on a slope and it's just, I don't know why I don't like that. It's just, I don't know. Let's hit this scorpion. Oh, did you see the damage? That other scorpion killed him though. Oh, this is actually a really good build, but this Dreadnought's not really the map for it. It does really well on Abyss and maps where there's cover. Oh, we need to be careful of this leech. Oh wait, was that our Mercury? I think it was. Maybe I can hit him. Oh, this guy's going to be a problem, though. See, look how quick the Cerberus can actually die. Wait, what is that? There's a Hawk. He's got Avengers on there, I think. We did a lot of damage to him. He's down to half health. Maybe I can still hit him through here, actually. See, look at that damage. Is he not even going to move? Oh, well, we killed him. <laughs> he should have moved there. Oh, my gosh. Oh, this guy. I might just go for him. See, look at this center. It's all tilted. I really don't like that. We need to be careful of these guys on the roof. Because I don't know what they're in. They can just drop down and kill me so quickly. We kind of need to get a beacon, though. We're literally five caps. I need to risk it. Yeah, this guy's going to hit me. What's he got? Pulsars or something. No, I think he's going to kill me. I need to heal. Come on, I need the beacon. Oh, I so nearly got the beacon. Right, I'm gonna use my Minos because this game's pretty much over. Oh, what's this Ming doing? Come on, steal it. Yes! We stole it. <laughs> Let's hit the leech. Oh, is that the end of the game? Is it? Oh, yep, that's the game. Okay, so here are the results for that game. We didn't actually do that well in terms of kills. Uh, here are the honor points. There they are. Uh, we got two kills, second place on the team, so that was pretty good. Um, I think this would do better on a different map, so hopefully we get a different map next time. Okay, so let's drop into the second game. Okay guys, so before I show you the second game, I want to show you a clip that happened to me. Um, as you can see, I got leached onto, and look how much damage this leech did to me. <laughs> I was so annoyed, so I kept going for it. Look how low I was. I'm at like, my mechanics is saving me right now. So I really, I only had one redeemer left. I was still going for kills. 
but I noticed this leech was moving up, so I decided to go for him because <laughs> look how much damage he did to my Cerberus. So I move around the corner here, <laughs> and the corrosion from the blackout killed him. <laughs> anyway, into the next game. Okay, so we have dropped in on Shenzhen map with this Cerberus. Hopefully I can get some more kills with this. Yeah, we have a Scorpion. I might, because they're all going to be too far away. I'm going to move to this. Oh, look at this. He's going to he's gonna kill him. Oh, no. He's barely doing any damage. Let's help out. Yeah, look how much damage we're doing here. Ooh. He didn't manage to get the beacon. Hopefully the Scorpion can move and get the beacon. We just lock that guy down oh if i had more ammo i would have killed him there i don't know he's still within range i might be able to kill him still oh it's lagging but yeah someone else got the kill let's just wait and lock this guy down too did it work he went into stealth let's try and hit him still we're still hitting him i think it's a loki yeah he's gonna move that way we're getting center but that Loki's moving. Oh, there's another leech. What does he have? He has Tarans. Why is he leeching onto me when he's got Tarans? I'm way out of his range. Look at that. Why is he doing that? I think I'm going to follow this uh, scorpion here. I want to see how long this can last in their spawn. Probably not very long. Yeah, this scorpion's getting low. He's at half health. So, what is this guy? Yeah, I, that's our leech. I don't know what's wrong with him. He really doesn't like me. What's this guy in? I hope he's not in a scorpion. Wait, is he in a behemoth? Oh, I'm going to get taken out so quickly. They are within range. Let's try and see if we can get a few kills. Nah, this leech is going to destroy me. I wonder, I need to wait for his ability. No, oh no, there we go. Why is everyone going into stealth? Every time I'm about to kill someone, they just go into stealth. It's so annoying. This nightingale is going to help, though. Can I hit this guy around the corner? I don't think I can. Maybe I can hit him with... Now nah, that guy. Oh, no. I need to hit this guy. Oh, what a shot. I locked him behind the building. Hopefully we can kill him I might move round but someone's hitting me I can't work out who it is oh there's a bit of lag there can I hit this guy no this is a bad idea oh no I'm gonna get taken out oh no oh now the leech comes out I need to heal maybe I can wait and lock him there we go that will give us more time to reload Oh, he got taken out. Did you see that? And Aljun killed him. Unfortunately, one of my Tarans got blown off. I've been in the wars. I don't think this Cerberus has long left. Oh, I can actually hit this guy. Yeah, I'm about to get taken out. Oh, no. I think he was going for the other guy, but he just hit my shield. I'm not going to die to an Alquin. No! How did I die? Some Someone's drone killed me. Right, let's use this Nightingale. I'm really curious to see how well this does. Let's try it against the Nodens. Oh my gosh, look at that damage. I'm just gonna fly. That was actually great damage. Let's suppress him. Oh, this wasp makes such a good sound as well. If I get the Typhon from the operation, I'm gonna buy a couple more wasps and run a quad wasp build because that's just been my dream on the live server. Let's see if we can hit this guy. Oh, okay, I think the Arthur's gonna take care of him. I really wanna hit the Nodens again. There's another Nightingale. The only downside to these weapons are the reload, because they take so long to reload. Oh, I'm getting suppressed. Where's this Nodens? I really wanna hit him. Ooh, look at that damage. Everybody's hitting him. I'm going to need to go into flight. Ooh. Let's heal this guy. Come on, you need to make a move. Hit the Nodens. He's just... Is he hitting him? I think he is. Oh, no. There's two more Titans moving in over here. Maybe I can move this way and maybe encourage them to follow me. 
No, I don't think it's working. I had to land. Is this the Nodens? Can I hit him? Oh, what? He died. Let's hit this guy. How much damage will this do against the kid? Oh, what? Oh, no. Why did this have to happen? I'm going to have to go into flight and I should still survive this. Oh, look at this. I can still suppress people. Oh, here we go. We're going back. Oh, gosh. Things aren't looking good. Oh, I should have been there to heal that guy. Wait, am I the last guy? Oh, no. Oh, no. Let's hit this Algern. Yeah, we did some decent damage to him. I'm the last guy. I'm going to go into the buildings. I'm just going to run. I need to wait for these weapons to reload. Oh, no. One of my wasps got blown off. Right, I'm gonna wait and then go into flight. Can I hit this guy? Not well. Oh no, go into flight! No! I got taken out. All right, let's use the Minos. This is gonna die so quickly. Oh, this guy, I might be able to kill this guy. If I just charge into him here and then... I might kill him. And then just go back round and we should be able to kill him. Oh wait, oh that's the game. Okay, so here are the results for that game. We only managed to get one kill with the Cerberus that time. Here are the honor points. Uh, we got second place on the team again, so that was okay. But yeah, overall, it was an okay game. We still could have done better with that Cerberus, but it was okay. I hope you enjoyed that Cerberus gameplay. Um, the Redeemer Tehran build is definitely a good build, but it's very situational. You need to be on the right map and you need to heal quite a lot in this bot because it does go down very fast if you don't heal. The Cerberus is pretty much just a lower version of the Typhon, so... I wonder how this would do with wasps, actually. I might try this out. But yeah, if you did enjoy that video, then please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.